What's going on guys, Junis Tech here back with another video. Now today we're looking at a pair of headphones, like in-ear headphones. Now sport and fitness is important. You know, everybody in their own shape or form does it, but listening to music while doing sports can become quite uneasy when you're wearing over the head headphones or in-ear headphones because nine times out of 10, if you're doing a vigorous sport or activity, they can come loose, they can come edged. So that's why I really have a great appreciation when it comes to sporting uh, headsets and sporting in-ear headphones. So that's what we're actually looking at today. So we're looking at True Wireless Earbuds and this is the Model Q11. So guys, what we're looking at today is the True Wireless Earbuds and this is the Model Q11. Now these are pretty much based on a more of a gym fanatic or running headphones, sport headphones, that good stuff. Now there's not really much exciting going on the box. We have a few things. So what's inside the box? So we get the Q11 earbuds, we get a charging case, a charging cable, ear caps, and also the user manual. And some of the specifications are it's wireless 5.1 connectivity, which is nice to see. Excellent sound, comfort, stay and secure fit. You get a waterproof and sweatproof uh, capability smart charging case and also a hands-free call so that is very nice to see so what i'm going to do is get these unboxed and see what we're working with so this is what we get in the box we have our charging cable which is pretty much a usb to micro usb pretty uh standard usb cable so not adequate for fast charging but still good enough for these type of headphones we get two extra sets of silicon ear tips which are nice to see and then we also get a small little user manual this is pretty much is going to tell you everything you need to know about getting it connected and all good, that good stuff. Now let's have a look at the case. So we all know when it comes to sport and sport equipment and headphones, their cases are normally quite large because of the size of the headphones, because how they fit in your ears. So as we can see on the back there, we do have the micro USB charger and then bracket for the actual swivel handle. And apart from that, that is pretty much all we really have on the case. We do have this little notch cut out, and then we also have a little LED indicator at the front there. So let's take a look. So yes, as we can see, large headphones. I'm going to quickly grab these out because they have a filament protection on the brass connections to stop them charging during transit. A lot of companies do use this and it really is good. It stops the headphones from charging while they're being delivered and all that good stuff. So I'm going to pop these back in to see if the LED, if there's any charge in them. Hopefully there is. No, there is no charge in them at all. So what I need to do is I need to get these charged later on just to test them out properly. But like I said, overall, they do actually look really nice. So yes, you do have a little LED plate on the bottom. You have two indicators on the left and the right showing how much battery each of these headphones do have. And then we also have an indicator in the center just pretty much showing you the percentage, which is nice to see. On the inside, we do have three little brass pin connectors. That's going to be the charging. And that's pretty much all you get in the case. So we do have more of an earbud design on the bottom here with a silicon ear tip. Well, obviously, you do get two extra sets of these. We have our three brass pins there, which are going to be for charging capabilities, and a little uh, notch there, which is going to be for your right or left. Now, we do have a rubber or silicon arm going on here. This is the part that's going to go around your ear. And I have to say, it is extremely smooth. There's no sharp edges or bevels. Normally, they get left behind on the printing. But ironically, they've actually been able to secure that very well, so that I'm sure these are going to be extremely comfortable. Uh, so on the front of this, they have went for quite a cool design here with the with the stripes going down, which is also nice, and then more of a square button there. We'll go into a little bit more about that when it comes to the specifications. We do have a little microphone uh, input just underneath there, which is also nice to see. And then we do have two uh, LED indicator and another microphone at the top, I do believe, if you can see that little LED lighting up. Might be a little bit too dull to see, but that's also what we get. So overall, for the sport equipment headphones, they do look relatively really nice, I have to say. So there we go, guys. That was the Model Q11 headphones that we were just looking at. And I have to admit, they, they looked great. They do what they need to. You know, they're supposed to be inside your ear and looped around the back of your ear. So it allows for more support. And that's the point of having a fitness set of headphones, you know. Yes, it doesn't come with USB Type-C, but it doesn't matter. The micro USB is well enough, uh, well and truly good enough. The battery uh, inside the case itself charges them for a long period of time. And I have to admit, they, they did really well, I have to admit. So if you are interested in getting yourself a set of fitness headphones uh, that aren't actually going to bother you, they're going to sit in your ear, be very comfortable. They're not going to come loose when you're doing whatever exercise you are doing or activity you are doing. 
Head down to the links in the description. There is a link there so you can go check them out for yourself. But I have to admit, they are amazing. If you are into your fitness and you are into, you know, going to the gym, running, cycling, and you want to listen to music at the same time, but you're scared that your headphones might fall out or slip over, I definitely recommend going to grab a pair of these. The case does have a built-in LED screen as well, which will allow you to see what your charge is via the left and right earphone, as well as the case itself. So it has everything you really do need. So like I said, all links will be in the description. And as always, if you do have any questions, drop them down in the comment section below. I'm more than happy to help. But as always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell, especially for the upcoming Christmas bundle giveaway. And majority of this stuff I am reviewing in the past several months is pretty much going to you guys that watch my videos. So thank you very much. I appreciate it. And I'll catch you on the next one.